Hello, Leo. This is your intuitive insights for the month of March, 2023. Leo, 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 you are looking for a fight, my loves. This month, you are fired up. You're either trying to advocate for someone, yourself or someone else, your partner. There's just, it's almost like it's not hard for you to see red this month. And a lot of Leos might be having a lot of fights with people, their significant others, their family. It's almost like betrayal is in the air for Leo. And it's just like this loyalty is broken. Like there is a trust that has been breached. And Leo, you are feeling like, I will never forgive you. And maybe your partner ate all the mustard, and that is a capital offense. I'm serious. You're going to feel like a bit crabby this month. And it's because of the fact that I think there is some depression happening. And Leo, I know this is rare for you because people say that Leos don't get depressed. They do. Especially around springtime. And I'll tell you why. Summer is like your your jam or fall, but it's almost like the changing of the seasons just changes your energy. And it's almost like this cycle. It's almost like a purging or a purification that it just needs to happen. And so you're going to be a little crabby for a little bit, but then you're going to be okay. Be really mindful about your spending though, because it's going to be like, I'm going to buy myself this nice thing to make myself feel better. It won't make you feel better. And in reality, it probably will make you feel worse because you're going to look at your credit cards and go, ooh, that was a bad idea. If you are with a water sign or if you're friends with a water sign, mm, it, be aware of their feelings because they're just trying to help you. There could be a lot of closure in, in that, in connection with, with, especially with cancers and water signs. It's just, mm -mm, it's not working well this month. And besides that, things look okay. Your neck is very tight, Cancer. It might be, or Leo. Sorry, I said Cancer. I didn't mean to. I just did Cancer. <laughs> Leo, your neck is very, very tight. And it it's almost because of the fact that you're just holding your shoulders up to your neck. And that is not fun. I suggest a massage. It feels like... You're holding on to something very tightly and it's very hard to let go or you're very tightly coiled this month. There could be a very good reason for why you're upset and I'm not discounting that at all. But I do think that you need to do a bit more self-care for yourself so that you don't feel that backlash, that guilt, that frustration there's some shakiness in your energy this month and it's almost like um, either shaking because you're upset or there's or sad. But I do feel like that if you can work through your feelings, sorry, then you can you can get through it you can get through and you can find that that silver lining, that positivity because, It's almost like if you remove that blockage, you'll see everything so clearly and be like, oh, okay. And go back to your happy-go-lucky Leo self. If you'd like to book a reading with me, Leo, you can find me at www.kindredinsights.com. Don't forget to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. And I will be a bit late to the party next month as I am going to be out of town with family. So I will see you all in the very near future. Brightest blessings.